Hey friends, welcome to my page, DIY Crafts with Dar. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> Happy Hump Day. How is everybody? Hope you're having a good week so far. Um, mine is actually going pretty good. Yeah, um, getting a lot of stuff done, getting tons of tons of orders out. Oh my goodness, guys. Sorry, got something in my eyeball there. Uh, yeah, yeah. So orders are like flying out the door, which is great. Tons and tons of other orders. I tell you, it's we're we're hitting some some goals that we've had for a while. So um, yeah, I we just we have some goals with different um, things in our business, and um, it's really crazy that this month we're hitting those after all this time that we've really we really set high goals for ourselves, and um, I. I don't like to brag and say all those things, but just know this, that I'm so happy for all of the orders that we get every day from you guys. We appreciate you so much. Um, it's just incredible, the support that we have and the continued um, patronage. We just, we love our customers. We're so happy when we say, oh, this is a repeat order. We know we know this person and, we, and we're getting new people too. So there's been, since I did the last transfer sale, um, a lot of those people are starting to buy now. So it has really picked up. We really don't ever have to go out and search for new customers. They just land in our lap and we're so grateful for that we're so grateful for each and every one of you and i have a fantastic project for you today with several freebies that you'll get um over in the vip group okay so as you know when um when things first launch they cannot be discounted at all so brand new frame okay so so this will be retail price retail price is 25 dollars. okay but it is a great frame. Okay, don't look at it and go, $25 for that? No, it is a fabulous frame. It really is. And uh, this part comes out. So we're not even going to use this part that comes with it. We'll use that another time. Think of this as an investment because um, it's interchangeable. So out pops this part. This, this is that surface, that plastic type surface that's a chalkboard, their chalkboard. We're not going to use that. I'm going to give you, I am going to give you for free, um, I'm going to give you the insert that's a piece of wood and then all the little cutouts, the little bunny ear cutouts that go with this, okay? So this will be retail price too because I can't discount that either. I love to give you guys discounts because you deserve it because you support me so much, but on um, things like that, I just cannot do that. So. Um, so this uh, size A is $11 and then this is $25. So $36. Okay. And then, um, I'm going to do free shipping for you guys. So I have this kit and guess what else you get? So if you need chalk paste, then I'm going to charge for that. So if you don't need chalk paste, that's fine. There's two options over there. So, um, if you don't need chalk paste, then you can get it without the chalk paste. If you need chalk paste, then I have a raspberry sorbet and shimmer, um, shimmer shadow and a squeegee. Okay. So if you're new, this is a great project for someone new. Okay. It really is. And then you can use this over and over. I think this should be on a onesie. Don't you think? I think it'd be really cute with this low enough that the ears are just popping out right below where, um, where the, okay. So here's the onesie. And then you put like little leg warmer, like, I don't know, little bottoms on shorts or whatever, the bottom part, um, popping out of that so that here's the pants and then this is the, the onesie or t-shirt. So I think that would be super cute for, for that. And then I'm going to also give you free. So you're going to get, you're going to get um, three free things and free shipping. So um, this is a stand. We're going to paint this because, and, and help me out because I'm trying to decide what color I want to paint it. It's a stand, okay? So so it, it, you paint these pieces, and this glues on the front. So we'll do this probably first so it can be dry. Um, this goes through the slot right here, okay? So it goes through the slot, and then it goes like this, okay? And then um, we glue this on the front. So this go, this gets glued right on the front. So it's just kind of decorat decorative trim. If you don't want that there, you don't have to have it there. Okay, so then this, and we'll just put this back in for the moment because you have to have something inside it in order to set that on there. Um, 
So this will sit right on here and that's your little stand, okay? So um, you get the stand free and it kind of, you know, it's at, at an angle, but that's just the way it is. So you can use the stand for other things. You can use it for other little signs that we have. You can hang this on the wall if you want to, options, okay? So on the back, if you did that, you would just use the little Velcro um, command strips. That, that will work. Anyways, so this easily removes. You can remove this and put other stuff in it. Um, it slides. Okay, let me put you down and then we'll start in a minute um, with everything, but I'm just kind of showing you all of this, okay? Oopsie, that is not what I meant to do. Darlene, Darlene, Darlene. Um, here, here's what I meant to do. All right, so see, it has the little things that slide. Okay, so when you put this in and you just press it and then these slide to hold it. So whatever these little things are called doodads, Okay, they just slide to hold it. There's four of them. All right, so that's what's going to hold that in place each time. So when you need to take it out, you just slide it over and you can easily remove this and put something else in here. So we're going to be using this frame. It's an investment. Okay, so like I said, $25 for the frame, $11 for the transfer. Um, if you want the chalk paste, I think that I, think that I just charged um, regular price on that. Um, but you don't have to get the chalk paste. And then this is going to be free. So you're going to get the insert. So it's going to go, I'm going to, I'm not going to put it behind there right now because those will fall off. And then you get the ears for free. Okay, so we're going to chalk that this morning. So we're going to do that. And then you'll get the stand for free. So you get three free things. Help me decide what color. What color should I paint this? I got out black. Should I just paint it black? Um, I just need to know because I'll paint it and I'll glue it together. I was thinking brown, but I'm kind of thinking just, just black. Um, you tell me. Okay, so I also have, so I have this, if you just need this part, if you already have the frame um, and you just need this part, I already have it posted over in the um, the Shopify website, okay? So I've already, I already have it over there. I didn't post, I didn't post this, um, but I can. I just haven't done that yet. I did post um, replacement. So I did, I did two, I did a two pack of these. They're inexpensive. I think it's $6 and 75 cents for two of these, which is great. Um, you can flip it over. You can do, um, paint one side, paint the other. With this one, um, I think just do, do it like this because you're gonna glue those onto it. And guys, we're not gonna glue them on until we get it in the frame because the fact that we have to have it up a certain um, distance because the back of it, you know how it has a little lip. So don't don't glue these at the bottom because they're actually gonna go up just a tiny bit. You see how it has the little lip right there? So once these are in the frame, we'll glue, we'll glue the little ears on. But this is going to be so cute. So I have 20 of these. I have 20 of these kits. It's gonna post in the VIP group. Okay, let's Let's do this. Um, let's get back to me for a moment. We'll say hello. <laughs> Welcome to my page. Thanks for thanks for being here, guys. Um, DIY Crafts with Dar. That's my page, and I'm so happy to be here with you guys. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good day. I just know it. <laughs> it just is. So um, let me see who's here and how did, how did launch go for everybody? Did you get to grab the things that you needed? I know something sold out. It shows that, that it's coming back. I haven't confirmed. I didn't look on the website to see if it's actually coming back, but the small spring um, spring market one with the bunny that we did last week, um, this the size A, the small one, that one sold out yesterday. I knew it would because it's so popular. I have some extras. If you didn't get one, you can actually add it to this order. You can tell me about it and just say, I want, I want to get this, but I also need that other transfer, Darlene, because I missed out on it. So you can, uh, you can send me a message. Um, those things cannot be discounted. We cannot discount within the first 30 days of launch. Okay. I love to give you discounts, but I have to play by the rules. We have to do that. <laughs> All right, so let me see who's here, guys. I've talked long enough. Sometimes I just like to explain, explain away. Oh, and let me just share it to VIP. Okay, so hope you all are having a good morning. Mine just started literally just like 45 minutes ago. I got up at six o'clock, which is, you know, usually that's about what time I get up. Let me share this to my VIP and then we will get started. VIP. Okay, 
perfect. Perfect, perfect. All right, guys. Um, hi, Betty. How are you? Hi, Deb, my sister. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Tammy. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, hi, Carrie. Good morning, April. You are not on the replay. You're live. You are live, girlfriend. If you don't see the red live button, um, then you're on the replay. But sometimes Facebook can trick you. Sometimes they can. So, hey, Chris, how are you? I know, Deb. It's so crazy. We we are just hitting all of our goals um, way early. It's only February, and we're hitting those goals. So we are really happy with that. So, hey, Mary Lee, how are you? Hi, Cheryl. Good morning, Laura. Hi, Lisa. Um, thank you. I, I love all the new stuff too. And right back at you. You guys are doing fabulous. I am so happy for you guys. It is amazing what you make with that machine <laughs> or machines. How many do you have? Um, hi Doris. How are you? My sister, black or brown. Okay. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Black or brown. Hi Shelly. Hi Janine. Hi Betty. Betty says brown. Um, I, I'm trying to decide. I, brown was not one of my, uh, um, one of my choices. Hi, Lisa. Black would probably be more of a choice just because it'll go with everything. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Marcia. Hi, Deborah. Hi, Kathy. Good morning, April. Hi, Denise. How are you? Okay, guys, um, just say hello when you hop on so that I know you're there. And if you have questions along the way, you just pop them in there and I will I will be happy to help you. We're going to paint that the, the easel thing first so that the front part can be drying. You don't have to put that little piece on there, but I kind of want to do it. So I want to make sure that it dries before everything else. Hey, Stephanie, how are you? You have five 3D printers. Holy cow, girlfriend, you have a whole warehouse going. That is awesome. I love that. I, I love being self-employed. Um, I, you know, I'm on year 39 now of being self-employed. Um, I've always, I've always kind of had almost always had more than one business going almost almost always because I just believe to not put all my eggs in one basket <laughs> even when I just had a really full-time job and I was working my 40 hours a week out of the house I still did stuff on the side because I feel like you just have to do that in order to make it work in this world you really have to do more than one thing and I am just so driven <laughs> to do stuff like that. And and you could you could say I'm motivated by money. I'm who who isn't? But I love I love setting goals and achieving them. I I used to do things like um okay, we're going to save up and we're going to get to go to Disneyland and I could take my kids and we would save up money and I would do that. My husband never liked to go, so I would take them for 3 days and I would wait in my my um, stepdaughter would come visit sometimes during the summer. And so I'd take all four kids and it was just me and them in a hotel for three days. And I saved up. Um, I just, I set my goals and I, and I always achieve them. So that's easy if you figure out step by step what you have to do. So yeah, one, one step at a time and it all works out. <laughs> So, hey Darlene, hi Stephanie, how are you? Hey Sandy, did I say hi? Hi Lori. Um, let's get started on this cute project. Let me put you down to the project. And let me put myself up in the corner. There we go. Hello guys. Okay, so like I said, we, we are going to be, you can paint this frame too if you want to, but this one I want to leave white. So um, I I will have multiple frames like this. So I some of them I will paint because I just want to. Um, you have your MRI this morning. Oh goodness, yes. Okay, we are praying that everything goes well. Um, should have the results by Friday. Hoping no. Oh, we're hoping to. Thirty to four days till you go to Florida. Oh yes, for your work trip that you won. That is awesome. We are praying for you for all good news. All good news, guys. Just pray for Laura that her MRI goes really well. So, oh, you had it already. Okay, you had your MRI. Okay, let's pray that everything goes great. I know, isn't the frame just so cute? It is so adorable. So so it comes with this. So, um, so you will have this surface that it comes with. It's reversible. Okay, so it's white. And it's black, so you will you will get that. Um, I'm gonna let me post the VIP group. That's where that's where this is going to post in like 20 minutes. The kit will post over in the VIP group, and if you want to buy it, you can buy it from there. I, I'm not the, I'm not all the fancy type that. Um, oh, hang on, it's not working. <laughs> Come on, Darlene. Um, I'm gonna post the link here for my VIP. There we go. I'm not the fancy type that is able to have things pop up when 
you type in like a keyword. <laughs> I'm trying. I might, maybe I'll have time to learn that. I One of my friends that knows how to do all that is going to Jamaica. Maybe she can teach me. I'll take my laptop with me or I'll take my iPad and we can do that. Okay, so there's, there's VIP group. That's where I'll have 20 of these kits available. And then if you already have this kit and you just need the other stuff, everything else is going to be over in the Shopify account. So what you can do is when you get to the Shopify account, did I get it in there? Um, I think I did. Okay. Um, honeycomb frames are great. I, I didn't see it post. That's really weird. Um, hmm. Anyways, it should be there somewhere. <laughs> That's so funny. I see it and then it's gone. Um, and my comments are behind on here. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Well, and, and we're not frozen, right? Are we frozen? No, nope, we're not frozen. Okay. Um, on my, on my screen, on my phone, I'm still at myself. So I'm way behind on comments. <laughs> and oh, it's, that is not even the right video, guys. What happened? <laughs> I'm like, what happened? It went to the wrong thing. That's why I'm like, it was way far behind. Let me do this again. So here's the VIP group. Okay, so there's that. And then let me give you the Shopify. It went to yesterday's video. That's hilarious. Okay, so there's the Shopify one. I'm like, why is it behind? <laughs> okay, there we go, guys. Okay, so these are great. These are the honeycomb frames. Now, um, they're, they're from Chaka Tour. And like I said, $25. I can't do any type of discount in the first 30 days of something launching. So the, the it price is what it is. But I'm going to give you freebies and I'm going to give you free shipping. Okay, so um, the kit today is... $25 plus $11 um, plus if you need chalk paste I have I have you covered if you don't then you can you have the option to do it without that okay so let's paint this black let's get this part done first and then we're going to do this I want to do this cut the background I'm going to do um, pistachio mint like a light green you can do it any color you want okay but let's do that second we're going to paint all I'm going to do is I'm going to paint um I'm going to paint the top part, the top part, um, the top part, and then we're going to glue that together so it can be drying while while we are doing the other part. So this just has to glue right onto here. So we will we'll set it down. Maybe we'll tape it so it doesn't move. Okay, so let's get that painted. Um, let me find a piece of cardboard somewhere <laughs> to just set this on. <laughs> All right. So... Anyways, guys, I love the I love the honeycomb frames. They are just so cute. It's an investment. Okay, think of it like that. Yeah, that it might be a lot for some people, but it's an investment. And we will be using that frame for a lot of things. So I have 20 of them available today. I already have them in hand because I ordered them last week. Um be, at, when I was able to pre-order, I ordered some extras for you guys. So I don't have to sit and wait for my order. It's already here. <laughs> so did everybody get what they wanted? I, like I said, the other little bunny one that we did the other day that, that stands up the, uh, what was it, spring market, that one sold out yesterday. We knew it probably would because it, we knew it was going to be really popular. We just, we just knew that there are going to be certain things that sell out, okay? Um, and you can never know you never know how many to get of something. Just like I never know how many monthly kits am I going to sell. I thought that the first month that 40 would be plenty, but we're like at 98. We had 98 of the January one sell. I'm I'm like, come on, two more. Let's let's get to 100. <laughs> Pretty crazy, huh? That we could sell that many. So here comes February. So we anticipate that okay, if you started in January. And um, then you probably are going to do February. So we would guess that probably an increase of maybe 10% each month. Let's put some of this black back. It's too much. Too much black. Too much. So if you're out there watching, just say hello. Tell me how your weather is. Okay. You, did you guys see my, my post of our crazy weather yesterday? So all of a sudden, <laughs> I, I think it was like 10 o'clock-ish. Um, or maybe late, maybe later than that, maybe 11 o'clock ish, maybe, yeah, maybe 11 o'clock on my phone. All of a sudden I got the warning that, um, tornado warning and I, it's a tornado warning, um, Shula Vista. I'm like, well, that's really weird. That sucks for them. <laughs> Okay, so I'm like, well, maybe I should check into this some more. 
And so we went and we, we, um, we turned off the lasers. We're like, it's looking pretty ugly outside. Let's turn off the lasers and let's just go watch the, watch the TV and let's see what's going on. So we shut everything down, came out of the shop, took the dogs into the living room and kind of stood over by the, by the hallway, which is the strongest part of my house, um, Aside, aside from the bathroom. So we stood over there and we watched on the news and we're like, oh, it's going to hit us. <laughs> the tornado was was coming directly towards us and was going to hit right around 12 something. So, we, so we're like, okay, all right. Well, uh, as it gets closer, we're probably going into the inside bathroom and going to hide in the bathroom. <laughs> So, so anyways, um, as we watch, we're like, okay, let's just see. Cause it was moving pretty slow. It was moving 35 miles an hour, which is pretty slow. Um, you have time, you have time to take cover. And they were, they were tracking it on the news. As it got closer to us, it turned directions and started going more of a, of an Eastern direction. So we knew it wasn't going to hit us. And then within about 15 minutes, it had, it had turned into just um, microburst, and um, so I guess that's more like just really torrential rain, which we got so much rain yesterday, guys. Tons of rain. One of my friends got seven inches at her house. I don't know how, how much we got. I actually didn't look, but at least probably two or three inches at my house. A craziness. <laughs> Crazy weather. You never would think that in... Southern California that you would have a tornado warning. I never would think that. <laughs> I we for for us we're like okay. I actually don't know what to do. Um, my grandkids at school were under their desks for over an hour. They kept them under there just to make sure. We actually did hear from a meteorologist that said um, actually Wednesday is more like perfect tornado weather. It's coming, so we'll be on the lookout today again. And kind of see, you know, I mean, we're always, we're always listening and it actually came across my Apple watch. Oh, and it's saying, I only have 8% battery left. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So that's, that's kind of funny. All right. Let me look at comments here. Um, let's see. Stephanie said you got the spring market transfer yesterday before it sold out. Nice. Nice. All right. And then then got cutouts. Perfect. Perfect. Hey, Karen West. How are you? Yeah, it was a little scary for us, but you know what? Um, it's it's okay. It's it's over with, and hopefully, hopefully, it's not going to happen today. It's just kind of funny that somebody, like a special meteorologist that does stuff like that, that tracks all of the um, tornadoes. They said today today actually is a better chance. Okay, so this is just going to slide in here. Um, once once I get, um, I, I'm going to wait. Okay, so once I once I um, get this glued on here then I can slide that in. Okay, so I'm gonna glue this. It's gonna glue right on the end because it's going to be this little fancy thing. And then this just slides in. So so um, you don't have to have it in there permanent. You can pull it out and you can store it flat, okay? But we're gonna glue this on there. And what we'll do is we're going to, we're gonna tape so that we have, um, we can have it flat, okay? So just a bead of glue along there. I'm not going to do hot glue because I think that that it doesn't need to have hot glue. So this is this is when the glue that is the quick drying glue would actually be better, but I think we'll be fine. So I'm just going to I'm just going to lean it up like that and then I'm going to move it over here and we're going to let it dry. Hopefully it doesn't dry. Um and I'm going to make sure that it's flat. Okay, so we're going to we're going to set it there, let it dry while we do this. Okay? So this is next. Hi Linda, how are you? Forgot to sign it. Oh, oh nice. Um tornadoes are your life. Hey, then you can tell me exactly what to do, Sarah. I will call you on the phone. <laughs> do I have three cameras going? Um I actually do. Okay? So I I can do a lot more um a lot of cameras. Okay, so what I have, Pauline, is I have a camera right here. Okay, I have a camera right in front of me, which is, okay, so this is an iPhone. Um, that's an iPad. And then right next to me, I have an iPad that I control everything with. I use Switcher Studios. Um, there's other types of programs that you can use that are not that expensive. 
um, that's just the one that I really like. So I use that. And then sometimes I will add my phone if I need to show you guys something. Sometimes I'll show you from my phone. So um, yeah, you can definitely you can definitely do it like that. For the longest time, I just had my one camera that pointed down to my hands forever and ever. I just I just did the hands down. So I like to have it in the corner for sure. Um, let me see questions. Okay. Oh, Stephanie, same, same there. Um, tornadoes in, in East Texas. <laughs> I will take all the suggestions that you guys have. <laughs> Tara was like, when she was a kid, she, she was always worried, how am I going to get that, the mattress on top of myself into the bathtub if I need to? Because <laughs> isn't that what they suggest is that you get in the bathtub and you put a mattress on top of you? Is that, is that for, um, is that for tornadoes? <laughs> So this is pistachio mint. I don't use this color very often, but I think it's going to be super cute in the frame. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. Anytime. I am always happy to answer questions. So I have in front of me is a ring light. So I have a ring light in front of me that is holding the iPad. Okay. And then up on the ceiling, I have, I have what is called a sky float. It attaches to the ceiling with a magnet. Okay. So I have metal plates on the ceiling where I can move that camera around if I need to. So, um, that one, that one can be moved. And then, um, to the side of me, I have another light to just give me a little bit more light. Okay. So pistachio mint, I think I'm going to put a second cup and then we're going to do our white for our bunny ears. Let me see if I can just get a little bit on here. I might have to get out a pellet dish. Maybe. Yeah. Cause there's not a lot left in there. So let me grab a pellet dish to kind of help me. Okay, and then we're gonna chalk. We're gonna chalk the ears, and we're gonna chalk the same. Um, we're gonna use this little stencil right here. So, um, this is this one's a chalk and tour stencil. It was super cute. It says thanks for hopping by. <laughs> you could you can use um, any size A in this. Okay, so I I'm gonna be selling the inserts. Um, they are just MDF and. Um, Chalk Tour so far doesn't have inserts replacements for these that I'm aware of. Um, they might in the future, but as far as I know, they do not have the inserts. And this is not a true 5x7. It's a little bit smaller. So if you got the 5x7 insert for, for the for the block for the box frame, it's not gonna fit in this. It's gonna be too big. So um, don't think that you can just get that one to fit in here because it's not the correct size. You have, it has to be just a hair smaller. You would just have to sand it probably. Okay. So there, there's that. Let's try and we're going to put a second coat on the white, on the, on the ears. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Yeah. The great thing with Switcher Studios is you can actually pull out a laptop and connect with it. If it was um, a Mac, um, it has to be like iPhone, iPad, um, a Mac book, that type of thing. So I can take my phone and I can connect um, Switcher Studios to my phone so that I can show what's on my phone. Sometimes I can do little um, field trips to my living room. <laughs> Not very often. It usually disconnects. But um, I actually, I love Switcher Studios, but they did raise, raise the price. And it was this last time when it renewed, I think it was $300, which is expensive to me. If you don't use it, I use it every day. So it's a business expense. But if you are just brand new, you don't want to pay that amount. You want to get one of their specials. A lot of times they'll be having a special and you can, you can do that special for a few months or something like that. And then if you like it, then you can sign up for the real deal, you know. So, okay, so second coat of white, get it all smoothed out. And then we're gonna do a second coat of the, of the um, pistachio mint. So, this is an older color. You could use any color that you want. Aloe would be fun too. Um, honestly, any color. This, is, this just reminds me of spring. And I think it's gonna look super cute in the white frame. Totally, I almost used berry chalk paste. I thought, well, that would be kind of cute to use berry. What do you think? Berry would be really cute. But then I was like, no, I really want to have green. Okay. All right. So let me go ahead and dry. I want to make sure I don't get that transfer hot because guess what? It will melt. I'll be sad. 
I'll be grabbing another one and going, darn, I just ruined that. <laughs> I actually, when I first started, I ruined a transfer with a heat gun because I was impatient and wanted to get it dry really quickly. Yeah. Now, I really like our Chocotour dryers just for if I'm not in a hurry because they won't melt your transfers. You can actually dry dry your transfers with the Chocotour um, uh, dryer. Okay. All right. So I'm going to pull this off and we're going to pull these off. We're going to do our ears first. We always, we always do whatever the cutout that goes with it. We do that first. Guess what? There's like a little white thing there. Let me just, let me just touch that up. There was like a little, little bump in there. So let me just touch that up really quick. I, I picked the bump off and then it needs more paint. <laughs> of course it does. Of course it does. Ah! All right. Make sure that you are sprinkling if you are not a designer because that is how you get into the drawings and that is how you earn ha happy mail. So we want to make sure that lots of happy mail is going out this week. I, ha I have a whole drawer full. <laughs> I have an entire drawer full of happy mail stuff. Um, I'm also working on a sale and I decided that what I need to do is I need to do a chalk paste slash ink sale for you guys because you guys bought so many transfers and people are saying they need they need chalk paste so we're going to do that next that will be the next thing okay the the right thing to do is to figure out what 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 orders are they going okay that one goes there let's figure this out first so we're not struggling and then we're going to flip this over and we're going to go in on okay let me just go closer for you guys so that you can see better because you know <laughs> Uh, it's hard. Thank you, Amy. Yeah, just let me know if you sprinkled so that I can get you in on that. It doesn't always show, honestly. Um, uh, Facebook, if your page is, is a private one, it will not tell me that you sprinkled. So um, I'm going to trust you when you tell me that you did. Okay. Okay, so they go like that. All right. So we're going to chalk them. So the center of them, we're going to use, I, I can't find my raspberry sorbet and I'm not going to open any because I have this luscious dream car right here. It's really close in color. So use whichever one you have. And then I have my, um, my shimmer shadow. Okay. I'm going to use, I cut some of my minis really small so that I could have these little tiny things that were like, um, kind of like a detail tool. Okay. So let me just scoosh this up some more so you can see everything. Um, oh, it's snow to Prescott. How awesome is that? I love it. I love Prescott. Pre Prescott, Prescott, right? Not Prescott, Prescott. Um, I love that city. It is it is just so fun. I love going and visiting my in-laws there. Just the cutest little place. Okay, so I'm gonna flip I'm gonna flip this over and we're gonna do like we did yesterday with the cow one and we're gonna lay these on here. So basically it's gonna be reversed. So I'm gonna start on this side and and then we'll fix them if we have to. If we have if any of them are like off a little bit, we can fix it. Oops, it's a little bit low. Ah, how low can you go? How low can you go, Joe? Hey, Joe, how low can you go? <laughs> okay, they're going to be like right next to each other. They actually, with they have a little bit of an offset. Um, when I cut them out, they have a little bit of an offset, and that just means that they have a little bit of an outline, okay? So um, when they're put onto this sheet, they're going to be right next to each other. All right, and then we're gonna flip it over. We're gonna make sure we don't need to move every anything. Okay, so so I just laid them down on the back. Um, oh yeah, that's right. Yes, yes, I remember. I remember. <laughs> okay, um, let me go ahead and move this one. This just needs to move just a tiny, tiny bit. Yes, I. Well, that's really cool. You're getting snow. I just love it. I, they're getting a ton of snow up at my cabin. Um, so like feet of snow, not just not just a few inches. <laughs> so I think I'm not gonna go this weekend. I kind of I kind of want to I want to go, but I don't want the dogs to to like disappear in the snow banks. <laughs> a lot of time, a lot of times the roads are still really bad, and people people are kind of they're not really smart about driving on in the snow. Honestly, because they're not used to it. They didn't grow up in it. So I grew up in the snow, so I kind of know how to drive in it. I'm not, I'm really actually pretty cautious about it because 
I respect it. I respect the snow. I know, I know how it can be. I know how easily you can slide into things. So I don't put myself in that position. Okay, so I'm just adjusting. So the inside part is going to be pink. We're gonna do a little bit and peel, a little bit and peel because the outside is gonna be the black. So we're using these teeny tiny little pieces that I cut. So hi Carol, how are you? You're saying your mother-in-law, yes, that's right. My mother-in-law works at the, that's right, yes. Yes, she does, that is right, she, yes. Okay, thank you for the reminder. <laughs> Okay, so we'll chalk this onto the the top part. Of the saying is going to go onto the top of that. Okay, so let's do let's do the first two, and then we will will peel. Okay, so when it, when you're using little slivers of this, sometimes it's hard to get pressure to have it go through. So just make sure you're kind of pushing. Um, if you have your little tiny detail tools, those work great. But Darlene, has, I'm, they're on order. Okay, so mine are coming. I ordered a bunch more detail tools because mine kind of disappeared. Sometimes they just get buried in my stack of things that I need to clean. Honestly, guys, I mean, I I go from I go from here right to, oh, there's a phone call already. I'm already on the phone with people for, for my other job. Okay, so I do bookkeeping and it can be crazy. Like the second that I get done here, my phone can be ringing and I need to do stuff for my boss over in New Mexico. So I, I have my other job. I love it. I love them to death. Um, this month is my 20 year anniversary with them, which is great. Who, I mean, I didn't, I didn't think that I'd ever be anywhere for 20 years. <laughs> that's, that's quite an accomplishment in my book. For, for me, for anyone, I guess, you know, there aren't too many people that stay with the company for 20 years anymore, really, unless you're military or something like that. My husband, my husband's had many jobs, but, but mine is mainly because they were willing to work with me and I can work from home. So even when we moved back from New Mexico, I was able to continue working. Okay, I'm going to peel, peel it off and let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Look at how cute. There's one ear and there's another ear. So the reason we did it white is because that was our background. And now we're doing the centers and the little outline. How fun is that? Hi, how are you? Crafting is going great. Okay, I'm just going to put them up here as we do them. And then we'll do we'll do the saying up here. Thanks for hopping by. <laughs> hey, Terry, how are you? Hi, Vicki. Good morning, guys. Okay, next next all right so i'm just carefully doing it but i'm making sure that i put enough pressure to for that um chalk piece to go down through the through the transfer there's a silk screen in this okay so if it was a stencil those would just be open areas all right stencils are different than than these these have a silk screen in them and that's how you can get all that teeny tiny detail is with the little silk screens so i i just love i love the chocotour transfers they're trans we we call them transfers, but they're yeah transfers slash stencils, whichever you want to call them is absolutely fine. I answer to it all. <laughs> I won't correct you because I a lot of times I'll just say stencil, but it's it's like a silk screen inside of that. That's that's what gives you the teeny tiny detail that you can get. Um, if it would like I've created stencils before on my laser so that was one of the first things that I did when I first got my laser stencils were a big thing for us we did tons of stencils custom ones for people um, it was not what I I didn't enjoy it okay so one of the things I didn't enjoy about it is that when you cut the when you cut the plastic which is a special type when you cut it with the laser it had a it has smell so sometimes smells really bother me <laughs> I don't know about other people, but there's sometimes the 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 burning smell of it just really gave me headaches. Um, and it wasn't toxic or anything like that, but it just was not was not a pleasant smell. Okay, can you hear that rain? I'm gonna be quiet for a second. Can you hear the rain on the roof? <laughs> I th I think I might fill in a little bit. There's like a little bit that I didn't press hard enough. So I'm just gonna take my stylus and I'm going to just um, gently just add a little bit right there and right here. Yep, 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 yep. There we go. Okay, so um, yeah, you can always fix it. You can always take like a toothpick or whatever you need to. Honestly, if I just had the right tools. <laughs> they're coming they're on their way I ordered more 
I my my detail tools are out there somewhere on the counter. I have some stencils that need to be washed that I just have been bad. Darlene's a bad girl. I I just haven't been great about keeping up with it because a lot of times as soon as I'm done, well as soon as I'm done here, I I um, upload the video to YouTube. That's my first thing, and then I'll take pictures and I'll post whatever I need to post and. Then I'll, and in the middle of all that, I'm getting the dogs outside to go potty. So the puppies right now are in their kennel. They've been really good. They, they're just so quiet. They're, they're just the best. <laughs> they really have been super, super good. I'm just so happy with them. You know, sometimes you'll get a dog and, and you're like, oh my gosh, what was I thinking? Because my life just, my life just got really difficult. They're not that way. They're just so happy with each other playing and, and um, Marley was Marley was playing with them last night. She did not want to go to bed with John last night. She stayed up and did the zoomies <laughs> with her sisters, making sure that she would run to me and, hi and hide under my office chair, or she'd run and, and jump up on the couch. Okay, I think I got everything. Okay, make sure you're peeling before it dries. You can't do all six of those and then peel because it will dry. So then I'm gonna just peel that. We're peeling, we're peeling. Okay, there's my other bunny ears. Okay, so I'm just gonna put my bunny ears to the side and now we're gonna do this little saying. Okay, we're gonna do it with our with our shimmer. Um, hi Virginia, how are you? Happy Wednesday. Look at how cute these are. So we're putting these into our our little honeycomb frame. If you haven't done chalking before, this is one this is one for beginners. It's not that difficult. And um, the frame, the frame's your investment. We're gonna be doing a lot of projects with it. We're taking out, this comes with the, it's a little, um, you can chalk on that, but, and you can erase that one. Okay, so these are wood, the ones that I have right, that I'm using right now, this is actual wood that I painted. Okay, so that one you can't change, but you can flip it over and do the other side. You can definitely do that. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're gonna center this the best that we can. And then we're gonna put this into our frame. And then we can glue on our little bunny ears. So I really don't wanna get the bunny ear part at the bottom. Um, I don't wanna really get any of that on there. So I'm only gonna press up here to get all those air bubbles out. And I'm gonna use our shimmer shadow for that. So this part's just kind of hanging there and nothing's touching at the bottom, okay? So I'm gonna grab my shimmer shadow and just plop some of that on there. If you can butter toast, you can do this. If you're looking at this and going, I can never do that, yes you can. So all you're doing is spreading. You're just you're just spreading that chalk paste and filling up all of the silk screen area, okay? So that's the first thing that you do. You don't even have to press that hard. You just fill that up, okay? So everything's covered, right? And then you're going to scrape off all the excess. And when you're scraping that off, that's going to press it down through that silk screen. It's pressing it down to your surface below. And you want it to be fairly smooth. So just go back over that again. And then you can peel that. And those words, the thanks for hopping by, are going to be underneath. But don't rip it off like a band-aid because what if part of it didn't go? You're going to just gently peel it up. Thanks for hopping by. Look at how cute that is and how, how nice and crisp. <laughs> So you can wash this and you can use it over and over and over. You can make a whole bunch of these guys. Okay, so let's dry everything. So I just wash it with water or you can use a Clorox wipe. Okay, if you're if you're somewhere and there's not water available, just have some Clorox wipes with you. Um, also, you can wash it when you get home. So don't stress over things like that because um, there's many times when I wash all my stencils when I get home from my craft show. Okay, let's dry this and make sure they're dry. Oh, you never seen that before. Oh, awesome. So cool. I'm glad to show you. Glad to show you. Okay, so let's dry. And then we're going to dry this. Dry all of our ears and not let them flip over. <laughs> Oops, and it's going underneath. There we go. All right, so you need to put it into the frame before you glue the ears on, and I'll, t I'll tell you why in a second here. And I also, I was thinking, do I want to ink the edges? I What I think I wanna do, I think I wanna ink the edges on this. Okay, so I'm just gonna kinda do that. All right, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna grab my ink pad, and I am just gonna ink the edges on this, because I think that's what I wanna do, okay? So I'm just gonna kinda grunge this up a little bit, I, you know, 
for me, the grungier the better. Just a little bit of the ink pad. This is, this is um, an ink pad. It's from Memento Lux and it's Espresso Truffle. It's a water-based one. So if I got too much on here, I can take it off. Okay, so I'm just, I just think it's, it's too white. Okay, so for me, I like white, but I don't like it too white. Okay, I like it to be more farmhouse-y. Okay, so then I'm gonna do the same with here. So I just kind of put a little bit of ink. Um, you, you know, you can always add more. So don't, don't go overboard. You can always add more and you can get out a little Q-tip and you can do the corners. If you can't get in there on the corners and you don't think it's looking right, grab a Q-tip. A Q-tip's your friend. Okay, and I kind of, I wasn't planning to do this, but guess what, guys? When I looked at it, the ears are going to, the ears are going to be right there and you want the ears to stand out. And I'm just kind of, you know, I like that, that grungy look. I just like to have a little bit of ink on my project. <laughs> so like I said, I have 20 of these available. If you are new and you want to try it out, you can definitely grab this kit from my VIP group. What time is it? Oh, it's already posted. So so you can go up to my VIP group and you can grab it there. Okay, so look at look at what that did. So, so that just added a little bit to it. Can you see? All right, so let me put the let me put that in. So you're gonna save this. You're, we're gonna use this at different time. Okay, so when Easter's over, um, or when, whatever we want to swap it out, we'll we'll do that. If you don't have chalk paste, you can absolutely get chalk paste with your order. If you have chalk paste, you don't have to get it. Okay, so this is going to go in the frame. You're just going to flip this over and just insert it. It's going to fit right in there. Okay, and it's going to fit pretty perfect. It might have a little bit of slop, which is fine. These little things right here, these little doodads, are just going to flip down and hold it in place. I call them doodads. I have no idea what they're called. Findings. I, I don't know. But anyway, so you just flip those down. And then look at what you got. So we got like this. We're going to put all of our little ears where they go. Okay, so we're just going to put them in order. And if you forget, just grab just grab your stencil. Where did I put it? Oh, right here. You can, you can look at it and you can go, oh, that's where that needs to go. Okay. So, and honestly, they can go anywhere that you want it to go. You don't have to have it exactly the same. If you want to put them in a different order, absolutely can do that. And just kind of space it out a little bit, however you want it. Make sure there's enough room and then we're gonna start gluing. Okay, so I always like to dry fit things. Basically, dry fit means I like to put things where they're gonna go and then I'll start gluing. Because then there's no surprises. Then there's no, oh, oops, I ran out of room. So I'm just kind of spacing them out the way that they should be, making sure that it all looks nice and even. All right, so how's that look? What do you think? I think that's super cute. Okay, so remember, you can use this over and over and over. Over and over and over. Like eight to, eight to 12 times is what corporate says. I use them until they can't be used anymore. Okay, so that looks good just like that. Uh, thank you. Thanks, Amy. I appreciate it. So make sure you're sprinkling. If you're if you're not sprinkling, then you're not going to get in on that sprinkle gift. I have some corners here. I need to just grab. I need to grab a Q-tip um, because those corners right there did not get any ink. So I just kind of want to make sure that all my corners have ink. Same here. So I'm just going to go back. I'm just taking a little Q-tip. That's all it needs all in these guys just to go like that and I love that green don't you love the green with that it is perfect okay so remember you're going to pay for the you're going to pay for the frame you're going to pay for the stencil you're going to get everything else free um if you need the the chalk paste you're going to pay for that of course but um yeah lots of freebies this time and free shipping <laughs> free shipping it can't can't be that I don't get free shipping very often because it costs me it costs me money but I'm feeling generous today <laughs> I was getting my thing um, ready last night. I'm like, you know what? I could do free shipping. Well, I think these will ship in a in a um, flat rate envelope. So that's what I was thinking was that, oh, I can put those in a flat rate envelope. It's only going to cost me $8. I think it's like $8.50 actually. But um, yeah, so so I'm going to do that for you guys. Free shipping. You, you honestly... Um, some big companies offer free shipping all the time, but they've padded that into their um, items. 
we don't do that. We, we keep everything low all the time for you guys so that you can afford to get stuff. So you, if you just need the wooden part and the ears, those are over in my, um, my Shopify website already. So just go to Easter. The other thing you can do is you can type in the saying. If you type in thanks for hopping by, um, it will pop up. Um, the other thing is that I have I have this set. So if you want to get two more, you can go to the Shopify website and you can get two more. Okay. Yes. Okay. So um, it's in the VIP group. Okay. So you're going to go to the VIP group. Let me just give you that link. Um, it doesn't pop up here. So let me just give you the link that you're going to go to when we're all done here. Oops, not that one. Not YouTube. <laughs> Backspace that out. I, I'm I'm trying to add this. I use boards. Do you guys, does any do any of you guys use boards still? That has all my stuff in it. I'm able to scroll. There's there there's that. Okay, perfect. Okay. So that's our cute little project. Look at that. Now, remember, I'm also giving you this. I'm giving you this cute little thing and I think it's dry. So you get dried to the table. Okay, um, the only thing I'm worried about is there's a little bit of glue right there. I'm gonna just take my stylus and get that glue out of there so that it doesn't stick to my frame and permanently glue the frame in. That would be that would be sad. I would be fixing that. Okay, so this is our this is our little stand. This is gonna come free too. So you're gonna get you're gonna get three freebies. You're gonna get the backer, you're gonna get the bunny ears, and you're gonna get this. This just slides in here. This is this is an easel. Okay, it slides together just like that. Okay, so see how that and then it's gonna sit like that. And this will just sit right on it. So I'm gonna flip you up to myself and I'm gonna show you this whole project. All right, where am I? Who am I? <laughs> there we are. Okay, look at how cute that is. So that's just gonna go on the easel. If you don't want it to go on the easel, use the easel for something else, okay? Totally. Um, the, it, it is at an angle. Let me show you the angle. That's, that's the angle that it's at, okay? If you wanna put it up on the wall, just use some of your, the, the little Velcro, um, strips, the command strips. The, those are those are really easy to use on the back of that. So you can put them on the back, or you can put a little hook, whatever you want. Okay, it's magic, <laughs> isn't it fun? Oh my gosh, I just love it. I love, love, love it. Okay, so there we go. I'm gonna go and close. Thanks for hopping by, guys. I appreciate you being here. Okay, so then, so then you're gonna have. Um, you're going to have this left over, so you're going to use this on another project, okay? So when you are done with your Easter, you're just going to flip that over, and you're going to uh, move your little doodads, and you're going to pop that out, and you're going to put something else, and then save this for next year. We will be doing many more things that fit in here, so just know that this is an investment. If you got one yesterday when, when everything launched, um, just you don't need to have the frame again. You can use the same frame over and over. Or if you want to have two, get another one. Anyways, I have the kits available. If you don't need everything, you just go to the Shopify website and search for thanks for hopping by. <laughs> guys thanks for being here this is my favorite time of the day i love spending it with you guys um this month was my month that i hit my five years straight of doing facebook lives without missing a day so i appreciate you guys being part of that we are going to do some fun things my life is a little bit of a train wreck at the moment just i'll tell you why because in the background I was spending hours and hours and hours each day networking with people still trying to find Chloe. Okay, I know that seems crazy. Um, we're coming up on almost three weeks of her being missing, but I'm not giving up on her. And in the meantime, I've got the puppies that I'm, pot I'm potty training and all that stuff. But I am spending hours and hours and hours working with another individual and then also working on my own, networking with all these different rescues and people that... Um, possibly might, you know, in different counties. Um, all, we're blanketing all of California, Nevada, and Arizona, the surrounding states. So just know that my life is a little bit cray-cray right now. So if I don't get back with you right away, I'm so sorry. 
Um, I just, I have to do what I got to do, right? <laughs> got to do it for Chloe. I got to try my hardest and there, there will become a point where we say, okay, we've done everything, everything possible. But right now there's still more. We're still networking. Um, we, we know that it's possible that somebody picked her up alongside the road that she was desperate and jumped in and um, she might have went to a rescue. So, so I am working with all those people, I'm constantly sending out things. I actually am mailing out flyers today to... There, there are four businesses that are really close to the other end of the canal where she possibly could be at, by now, it's like 15 miles. And if she did like a mile a day, um, which is a lot for a little dog, but it's possible, she would be at that point. So I'm mailing them flyers so they have them in hand for the weekend. Um, yeah, so there's a lot going on in my life. Anyways. I love you guys. Thanks for being here. I'm sorry about the long explanation. Sometimes I just have to tell you guys because you've been such a part of of Chloe's life. I mean, it's like she's your dog too. So just know that I'm not keeping up on her. <laughs> I'm still fighting the fight. <laughs> but I love this project. Don't you just love the project? Isn't it just so fun? This is just so darn cute. And it was super easy. It was not difficult. You saw how easy it was. So um, hop on over there and grab you a kit and I'll get that right out to you guys. <laughs> All right, guys, have a wonderful day. I love you guys so much. Um, I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. Bye, guys.